Hello there, welcome to the Perfume Experience. Welcome back to another video and I have two fantastic fragrances today from the house of Paris Corner and these are part of the Expression series. I have the Oon and I have the Troy. Okay, so we're going to talk about these fragrances and find out how good they are and all about it in this particular video. But before we go ahead, if you like fragrance related content, then definitely hit the subscribe button and click on the notifications icon to get notified about new videos and new things about fragrances almost every day or in three times a week in this particular channel. Right, so on that note, let's get going. You're watching the Perfume Experience. My name is Rodney. Let's get started right after this intro. All right, so welcome back. So it's getting hot. Bangalore is hot, 38 degrees, and there's a water crisis as well. So getting to shoot this, all of this is becoming very, very difficult in this heat. But nonetheless, we'll have to keep going with regards to fragrances and all of that, right? So yes, so I have two of the uh, four fragrances today with me, and I'll get the other two after a few days, and we'll probably do another video next week. So this first one here, we'll let's call this, or rather, this is called Oon. So this is from part of the uh, you know expression series from the house of Paris. Called now this is a dark blue colored box which looks like this and at the back there is this nice uh, artwork overall the presentation and the quality of the box is really really good and on the left hand side you will see some uh, writings basically talking to you about saying it is one or un in France or in French and uh, this particular one we'll talk about what is this all of. but when you open up this particular box like this you will be basically presented with a bottle here and uh, the bottle is like this this is a very good looking bottle in my opinion I like the way the color of this particular bottle is the gradient finish of blue and green is very very nice and it looks very beautiful in this particular uh, you know light as well so uh, right at the top you have this plastic cap which has got like a diamond kind of thing which is not so great it falls off very quickly but the bottle itself is very very nice and at the back it talks about own being written and you can see there is a little bit of a liquid I'm not too sure if that is visible but there is a little bit of a partial on this particular bottle and uh, this uh, is a transparent bottle which looks very very nice like this right so this is own okay and very quickly let's talk about uh, the Troy uh, packing as well the Troy comes in a green colored box like this uh, with the expressions written at the back and a similar kind of a box opens up like this the only difference is there is some amount of writing that is here which is different for each of these this is the way Troy looks like okay and the Troy is in this light green kind of a bottle which is opaque and in this the liquid uh, seeing the liquid is a little more difficult but the bottle itself looks very very good I kind of like both the bottles right now that I've received uh, like I said I'll do the other two after a few days right so let's keep the presentations aside and let's talk about the fragrances and let's get going with Oon first all right so let's talk about Oon so Oon is a nice fragrance and you will mostly know that these are all oils of popular fragrances so let's do a spray very quickly right so you you get a nice opening you get a nice freshness you get a nice opening of grapefruit followed uh, you know by some spicy element of some ginger and of course you get a good amount of ambroxin musk kind of a you know layer but mostly it's ambroxin and you have some nice woody elements and that's primarily what you kind of get but it's a fragrance that opens up with a lot of freshness of citrus and a good amount of spicy opening nice opening of ginger okay and immediately if you know grapefruit ginger and if you know you know ambroxin and all of that you kind of you know already are able to figure out that this is an alternate of bailari's tiger okay so that's what this particular fragrance is so Oon is a clone of bailari tiger right now it, it opens up pretty nicely this opening is very nice very smooth very uh, mellow very nicely done kind of a fragrance and uh, you know it projects for about 40 to 50 minutes time and at that point of time it's about two feet of projection it lasts for about um, about I would say four and a half to five hours time mostly you will be able to sniff on your hand or uh, even after about six hours time also but I would say the good amount of performance you will get for the first three hours and the third to fifth hour is very light very low and then of course after the sixth hour and whatever is very very skin close right but on your apparel, you will still be able to smell it for a little more longer. So it's a very nice clone of Bailari Tiger. But I would say that for me, it's a very smooth, very mellow, very softer, nicer version of Bailari Tiger in the in a way to say, right? For me, the best alternate of Bailari Tiger, I feel, is the Rue Broca Theorem. Now, Theorem, for example, screams really, really loudly. It's a beast kind of a fragrance. It's loud. It projects to more than three feet. It lasts more than six, seven hours time, right? Uh, at least about five to six hours very well. And after that, you will still be able to sniff it. So from that point of view, I feel that is the flip side of this particular fragrance where 
दिस वन इज नॉट एज लाउड एज यू नो प्रोबली रूबरो का तीरम और फॉर दैट मैटर द ओ जी ऑफ टाइगर इट सेल्फ राइट सो दैट वे आई फील दिस इज अ लिटल मोर लाइटर बट दिस इज मोर वेल राउंडेड मोर प्लीजिंग इन द सेंस टू से दैट इट इज नॉट टू वेरी लाउड एंड दैट वे पीपल वो लाइक सॉफ्ट सेंस एंड एस्पेशली पीपल वो हैव बीन अफ्रेड टू यूज टाइगर और रूबरो का थीरम थिंकिंग दैट इज टू स्ट्रॉन्ग इट्स टू हार्ड फॉर देम फॉर देम आई थिंक दिस विल बी एन एक्सलेंट चॉइस टू कंसिडर बिकॉज ऊन fits that ballpark between the loudness that uh, you know rubro ka theorem brings in or of the og tiger it sits somewhere in between and that way it's a very very nice fragrance right but you can't take away the refreshing polish blended well blended beautiful smoothness that's there on this particular fragrance that is something really really good and plus you get a 100 ml of this uh, for about 2400 rupees roughly which is also a fab deal if considering the presentation that you get for this particular fragrance so overall is this the best clone of tiger out there probably not in my opinion i would still say that theorem is really really good but is this a very good balanced smoother cleaner nice mass pleasing version of bilari tiger probably yes and for that all credits to this it's a really really good alt out there if you really like a nice version of uh, bilari tiger you can definitely consider this this is good value for money considering the fact that you should get a 100 ml of it for about uh, between 2500 uh, to 2700 rupees approximately i would say uh, in the earlier time when it was launched i think it was a little more lower but i think the prices have slightly gone up now so if you get it around 2500 to 2700 it's a good deal to get and now that paris corner has come to india and they have their official website as well so you should be able to get it very easily so you should really be uh, you know struggling to get this so yes as a good alternative of bilary tiger this is oon okay now let's go to the next fragrance this is a nice one as well i kind of like this one a lot i kind of whenever i've tried it uh, i have enjoyed this fragrance because this is a alternate a lot of people have been looking for and i think in the market right now this is one of the only middle eastern alternates for this particular fragrance and you should kind of get it if you like this particular one and uh, i can clearly say that in the decants that we launched this was one of the fragrances that was you know most popularly uh, opted for by a lot of people right and for the right reason this is a nice citrusy fragrance it's got a good amount of citron it's got uh, citrus it's got tangerine orange that kind of citrus opening followed by with a lot of sweetness and uh, there is a sweetness of uh, cinnamon also on this particular fragrance also you will also have ginger as well so that is a common element so you have ginger you have cinnamon and you also have some woody elements i think some cedar as well but on the whole this is really really nice it's a very clean very beautiful citrusy fragrance with a good amount of sweetness right now here in bulgari tiger the sweetness is not there but that gingery spiciness is there here the ginger note is there but here the ginger note is much more softer it's the cinnamon that plays that sweetness onto this particular fragrance plus with that ambroxan and the woody nature of the fragrance this is really really nice and so in case you don't know that this is an alt of the louis vuitton's imagination so this is really really good in that way so it's a imagination alt and there are very few fragrances out there which are really good alternates of imagination and a lot of people have been looking for this so if you have been looking to get a good citrusy fragrance a fragrance that's going to be mass appealing a fragrance that's going to be liked by a lot that can get you compliments yes then you can definitely consider getting troy of uh, you know not stag expressions which is an alt of louis vuitton's uh, imagination now in terms of performance i say this is also of softer scent i would say this also does about 2 to 2 and a half feet but this does something very nice is that this performs really really well in my opinion because whenever i wore it especially for indoors for office use and all of that easily you can get about 5 uh, 6 hours of performance while in the 5 to 6 hours performance it is still about 2 feet only but the first 1 to 1 and a half hours time it does very very well you can kind of you know keep smelling the fragrance for a good amount of time 1 and a half to 2 hours time it just does that but after the 2 hour mark it kind of lightens up but even after 6 hours somebody asked me that are you wearing the fragrance and you know the kind of immediately kind of can smell that so that way this is a nice fragrance to uh, have in your collection action so yes it does get into the 6 hr mark but it gets a little skin close after that but even even uh, after that i have been able to smell on my apparel for even about 8 hr time as well so performance is good performance is longer but not loud like what you would want to kind of expect like not like beast mode kind of a fragrance but it's very very nicely done for about 2 feet to 2 and a half feet 
lasting is good and i would say that in my opinion these two scents are excellent for office wear that's why i kind of think if you like uh, citrusy clean nice sweet smelling uh, complement mass pleasing kind of fragrances then both of them are really really good un and troy both are really nice for office use and this is also a good one so and one thing you must uh, you know uh, appreciate paris corner for is that the way the presentations are of these fragrances and the uh, scent quality is really really good you don't really expect Paris Corner suddenly to you know give you this high level of uh, alts or this high level of blends that is something that you must really give credit to them and they have done a fab job in it comes to both of these fragrances and yes in case you want to buy these fragrances or get their decants you can definitely contact us on the day, uh, you know whatsapp number above and we'll be able to get in touch with you and you can get this from us at a very good reasonable price so yes so this is an L uh, Bailari Tiger Alt and this is an LV Imagination Alt both citrus fragrances both of them have got ginger both of them have got woody notes but the way in which they work is slightly different this is more aggressive i would say this is more mass pleasing more uh, gentle more complimenting both are fantastic fragrances that you can definitely try for the summer on a budget right so that has been my very quick review about oon and troy from the house of paris corners expression series and i will do the next two which is uh, the uh, quatre which is an alt of afternoon swim which I'm told is probably the best in the series and then of course the duo which is also the uh, version of Leighton that also we'll do so probably next week or so right so if you like the kind of video that I bring and the content that I bring please hit the like button subscribe and share and you're watching the perfume experience follow us for more lovely fragrance related uh, topics and content until another time take care bye now